Hello everybody, how are you doing today? Um, just a very quick video, just to quickly update you guys on a few things. It isn't anything too exciting. Um, I apologise I've not been doing hardly any, any videos, that's for two major reasons. One reason I've been very busy at work, another reason is I've been working towards my house extension. I believe my house extension is going to cost me about 600 gold, so any time I have been on I've been trying to farm enough to get up enough gold for me to do that. I think right now I'm about 550 gold, so I'm getting close now. Um, so I'm hoping in the next few weeks to have up a video, excuse me, that will cover my house extension from tier 1 to tier 2. So that's what I'm hoping to do, but um, apart from that I don't really have anything else that I would like to do a video on until the new expansion is out. Nobody really knows when it's going to be out. I suppose the plus side is it seems like they're trying to get it fairly well finished and hopefully it will have a good level of polish. Excuse me, but my my mouse was going all over the place there. Hmm. Um, I would like to give you guys a warning the past few weeks in Meduli have been really crazy with griefers. I've been, well, I think I've lost about three or four horses. Well, I've lost three horses here in Meduli. Um, they were all while I, I was butchering. Um, I tried to be really careful and kind of butcher in off peak times when it's usually like super quiet. But still, um, I had three horses that were killed, some guy with a with a bow will basically um, pop up and uh, kill my horse while I'm trying to um, trying to butcher. So that's very annoying. They basically use a bow and they somehow shoot at your horse and kill it. Uh, yeah, so it's kind of annoying. And a shout out to K Master. He bumped into me earlier and said hi. Seems like a nice bloke. Just start the game. Enjoy your time. <laughs> um, yeah, so just be careful in Maduli. If you see a guy who is in rags and he has a bow on his back, more than likely he's a horse killer and he'll try to kill your horse. So all of the while you're standing on your horse he's not able to do anything but as soon as you dismount your horse they can use their crazy trickery to use their their bow to um, to kill your horse and it's kind of annoying like I was using very very basic horses but even those kind of horses it, it's still still gonna take the tamer character I have about 15 or maybe 20 minutes each time I have to tame one of those horses for my butcher so that was kind of annoying as you can imagine so just be careful and that has kind of hampered my ability to earn like money faster because it kind of slowed down my butchering a bit um, at one point my butcher character was stuck with loads of carcasses on him the horse was killed I was stuck at the butcher table with like loads of heavy stuff so yeah that kind of stuff is annoying um, also uh, as well as that um, I wanted to point out something that maybe some new players are not aware of why do you always see people in Maduli walking into the nets well, this guy is walking into the net, so he has pressed the, I think it's the num lock. Yeah, if you press the num lock key on your keyboard, that's like auto walk. So if you auto walk into this and you make sure that you're going to stay here and auto walk, obviously that will upgrade some of your skills. Um, on your character. Now this guy here is doing it but he's wearing armor. Now he he's doing that because that will basically get your armor skill up. Now I've been trying to get my armor skill up enough. I think you need to get it up to a hundred the basic skill before you can do the heavy armor training and you'll need a book for the heavy armor training. Now I've been trying to do it in a natural way and I've been wearing on my fighter character 
regular armor for what feels like a long time, like a few months, and still my um, armor train armor training I think is only about 88 or 90 so I still have a way to go but if you if you do this if you do the the numlock thing you're wearing the, the armor and you're walking into here I think you also have to have a weapon or it has to be in combat mode I believe for you to get the skilling up of your armor uh, stats so it's a a thing a lot of people do kind of AFK and it kind of is a faster way of building up your armor stats I would um, I would have a look on the forums I'm sure there's more further explanation in the forums or you could, if you're in a, a guild you can ask someone higher up in in your guild who has an idea about this I have have never actually done this as yet but I I I would imagine at some point I might have to do this but yeah so far I haven't but just to let you know if you see people randomly walking into nets like this that's what they're doing okay so that was a quick update um, I wouldn't imagine I'm gonna have a lot of videos um, over the next few weeks I'm really waiting for the new expansion to come out Awakening I mean obviously when that comes out I'll have a lot to talk about right now I'm just really going to concentrate on my house so you should expect a video on my house expansion in, in the next few weeks I don't really have that much else planned uh, but yeah I hope you guys are enjoying the videos and I'll see you in the next one thank you and good night